Hello everyone. In this video, I want to demonstrate how to conduct an ordinal regression. So once we have data in, just simply go to the analyses and ordinal logistic regression, and we'll see if we can predict poverty. And we'll have our independent variables as religion, degree, age, and gender. Okay. And we'll hit calculate. Here, like all the other analyses, we have an introduction, which just talks about the test name and the variables involved. We have an assumption of uh, variance inflation factors. Basically, are these things highly correlated to each other? And if they're over five, there might be a problem, but we don't have any problem here. We run a proportional odds or likelihood ratio test was significant. And as we can see here, the data did not have a good fit for the proportional odds model. And the results, you can see that the results of the model were significant, suggesting that these independent variables did predict poverty. We talked about Fadden's R square. And then we get into the coefficients. And um, I'll just jump down to our APA seventh edition table. And here we can see female gender one was significant. And in the write up, uh, we can get to that. So if we look at right here, okay, the regression coefficient for gender female was a significant predictor of poverty, okay, being less than or equal to the one category which is low poverty, as opposed to the higher category, and suggests that a one unit increase in gender female that is going from female to male would decrease the odds of observing a higher order of poverty by 16%. And you can look over the others for the interpretations. If they were not significant, uh, they are not interpreted. And when you're finished conducting the analysis, just go to download document, and that's how you conduct a ordinal logistic regression using intellectual statistics.